Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. I appreciate you stopping by. You're watching 412 PSC Customs here on YouTube. For those of you who don't know, my name is Matt Sr. I'm the founder and CEO of 412 Public Safety Equipment Customs here in Pittsburgh, PA. We specialize in custom-built specialty vehicles uh, for police, fire departments, construction, towing, utility services, any unique vehicle that has to be built and modified to provide a service to the public, we do them. Big or small, we do them all. Give us a call. We can definitely design and uh, set up your next project with you and deliver exactly what you guys are looking for. So give us a ring. So without further ado, uh, this was a requested video. So this is going to be a very simple video without much talking. I'm gonna to explain to you that this is a Phoenix Fusion Mini X light bar in front of us. This is a dual color version with the magnet mount kits and the 12 volt cigar or cigarette plug, however you guys choose to describe it. This is a dual color version. Now this is set up amber white and it utilizes all 40 degree optics. <clears throat> this is actually one of my bars. This video was requested, so this is what we're going to do. I'm just going to shut my mouth. We're going to fire this thing up, go through the patterns. We'll do both sets of patterns with the single color, and we'll go into the dual color, and then we'll leave it at that. So enjoy. I may have to turn on the darkening filter. Let me see here what we end up with if I darken this thing down. Yeah, I think I'll leave that darkening filter on because once we get into the white, it's going to get a little bit crazy. One thing I do want to mention, um, and you guys have heard me talk about this before, um, the kind of progression of the industry as far as amber LEDs is concerned, um, those of you that are well versed in our industry, you know what I'm talking about, how the amber diodes that they're using now don't have um, a very defined amber color. It's almost like we have um, transferred, uh, transformed amber into a yellow. Um, I, I have to say, I think Phoenix has a pretty decent amber diode that they're using uh, i think theirs is a has a little bit more of an amber tinge to it rather than um 
the yellows that other manufacturers have been using. <clears throat> you guys have to bear with me. I, I do apologize. I am a little bit feeling under the weather, so I got my day quill uh, to get me through the day, but it's one of the other reasons why I'm not going to talk too much. Alright folks, so here is the 
dual color version or set of patterns i guess um what i did want to um kind of show you guys is the um three position activation switch um which gives you the two modes so i have um we're going through the patterns in mode one and i have mode two when i throw it as your full flood override now i've mentioned this before unfortunately when you have the 12 volt power plug in the dual color it kind of eliminates a few features such as cruise mode number one uh, and also it forces you to use one of your programmable modes for the full flood feature if that's something you're interested in utilizing um, you know anybody looking to utilize a full flood feature I always recommend the hardwire version because with the hardwire version it comes with a dedicated flood trigger so you don't have to sacrifice one of your programmable modes you still have mode one mode two and the full flood override as well as of course the availability of the cruise mode
Okay, folks, so there you have it. <clears throat> that was the requested video for the Phoenix Fusion Mini X. 40 degree optics all the way around. Dual color, amber white. All three sets of patterns. Showed you guys how the flood mode with the 12 volt cigarette plug is forced into one of the programmable modes that is if you need the full flood if you don't need it great you still have your two programmable modes you're all good all said and done thank you guys again for stopping by if you like this video and its content you want to see more please smash that thumbs up button it definitely lets us know that we're doing something right if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, or requests, put them down below. We love to engage with you guys. We love when you guys request uh, new videos. Uh, we have a couple other uh, products that we have to get taped here and uploaded, so stay tuned for that. Please share our page, Facebook page, our YouTube channel, any of our social media. Um, we're trying to broaden our spectrum as far as our content um you know getting in touch with uh first responders um and um you know industries in our field that definitely can benefit from the content service and equipment that we offer uh, remember we are the industry experts highly respected highly trusted uh, if you have not subscribed yet, I ask you to please do so. It greatly helps us out. Plus, you click that icon, make sure that you don't miss out on any of our uploads. Um, we don't necessarily upload on a consistent basis, don't have a schedule due to um, our busy schedule. So, you know, we, we definitely get to things with every bit of spare time that we have um i want to give a shout out to my third grade daughter and her kindness club hashtag be the kind kid folks please be kind to one another out there it is contagious and with how decisive this country is right now we just need love and kindness get it out there treat one another like you would want people to treat your family members. And until next time, be safe out there.